hey guys welcome back to my channel thank you so very much for clicking on this video i really really appreciate you stopping by and i really want to say thank you thank you thank you i do hope you stick around because today we're doing spring haul okay so the spring is spranging so uh i wouldn't say change of wardrobe really because i incorporate everything but i just put a little bit more color to my outfit to just make it you know brighter you know you know because it's spring it's going to be summer soon which we're excited but in houston right spring does spring <laughs> can you can see me i'm really hot like right now it's like the what's the what's the way i think it's like 87 88 and this is supposed to be spring other people other states have uh, other city have like 40 something and Houston is like don't include me get someone else to do it so I do hope you stick around because most of the stuff I get obviously you, you guessed it from TJ Maxx and most obviously TJ Maxx has clearance and also discounts like I don't even know that TJ Maxx does this much clearance like at Houston. The amount of clearance that TJ Maxx does like every two weeks is just amazing. It blows my head. I just not like just regular stuff, even the designer pieces. Last time I saw this crook in box just going off topic. I'm sorry. I'm going to be back in a minute. They had these YSL Sac de Jour in baby in crook black crook effect and it was like i think it was like 2100 for them and i already have the regular baby you know sack the jewel bag but i always wanted some crook effect from you know ysl beads i was more wanting it in the sunset so when i saw it i was like oh that's nice really pretty so i didn't think about it i didn't go for it two weeks later i went back and I saw it on Clarence for $1,500. I was so mad. That was, I contemplated buying it and selling the one that I had. So a lady was, a young lady was there waiting to see the same bag. I had it in my hand. And I was like, you know what? That's just so stupid, me thinking about this. Like, just pass it on. So I just let her uh, look at it. And she finally took it. I was so mad <laughs> because I wanted something. So I'm crying. It, it's beautiful like beautiful but anyways as i said we're gonna be spanking some spring hot today so let's begin i want to do nostrum rag first because you know we're gonna do nostrum rag, right nostrum hag is not 40 percent. i think it was 25 percent off clarence you know your girl is gonna be in it okay so this is um uh, that is the nostrum rag bag okay betty so i always wanted to get something from this this um brand house this alice and olivier because they're they're close to be just like you know doing its thing and but it's always expensive and whenever you have it on clarence they're not like clarence clarence like the clarence that i want so i don't always go for it but i've got this paint oh i'm springing like oh this wide leg paint and it has this like goddess here okay i think this is a large large and normally we have medium but because of this i can wait and there's enough room here you know what and then there's pocket <laughs> it's literally pocket so gorgeous piece and the original price of this was three hundred and ninety five dollars so they had it on clearance for ninety eight seventy five and it was doing twenty five percent off i think i got it for like seventy two dollars and we're gonna be springing springing this spring okay and then the last thing i grabbed they had a lot of stuff that i would have grabbed but as you know i'm really trying to be good this year <laughs> all of us said on youtube we don't ever be good it's a disease okay so the next one i grab is this shiny oh let me bring this skirt look at that slit did you see that slit a slit whatever it is rather to you know it's down to my it's like a midi length okay 
it has zipper to the side and this is from one of my favorite houses and this is by from free people i got it size 10 i wear size 8 or size 10 so it fit really good and original price of this was 128 um, when I'm clients so for $49.99, I think I grabbed for like 30 something dollars. I can't remember, but I am so ready for any wedding. Whoever is out there that is doing wedding, you're living in Houston, please invite a girl because I'm ready. Please don't make me just keep this in my wardrobe. If not, I'm gonna wear it every day. Every day, I'll just wait and be guying, just be doing guy outside. So you're bad, you're bad, link your girl. Okay, so those are the few things I grabbed. Jeez. Okay, you did good, Betty. You did very good. Let's jump into TJ Maxx, which your goal every time I walk into TJ Maxx, I lose control. Here we go. I just really lose control. So let's do clothing, clothing pieces. I grab this core, core hurt, core, core set, whatever, that I've worn already for spring. And I'll probably pop a picture here so you can see because I took some nice pictures. And this is the how we look so so pretty and that is the pants and i grab in size 10 size size 8 us 8 and this is by house of helen as they have been really involved in, in, involved obsessed with the house of helen of lately like i have so much pieces from their houses because they do some create some nice thing this Paint. let me just talk about it this material is a little bit thicker that's what I, one thing I like about it I'm not it's not a linen it want to look like a linen it's a little bit like a fake linen um, I like that it has this little thing here and then it has pocket it has also pocket to the back but you can access it so it's just I think it's a fake pocket I mean it's maybe a real pocket but it's just got a cut sometimes they just sew up the pockets but well, not cutting out but i love that it looks like linen sorry for the whatever the lights you know um and it's not really linen this one was a little bit expensive for me but i just wanted i don't have anything like this and when i put it on i felt i was feeling myself too much so i just went ahead and bought it i think i bought it for 49.99 or something like that oh it's just so expensive but it's okay and this is the top it has this like back out right here and you tie it. it's like it remind me of like the 90s and i like that it has a little bit thin you know so that is the first dress that i um outfit that i got and then the second dress that i got is also size eight and it's by taylor like just the regular taylor um this one was 32 dollars i like that it is maxi dress it is very 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 long i might need a tall heel to get this off of the floor so i don't clean the the streets of houston but i love that it has that v cut to the front and then it just hangs on your shoulder i'm gonna leave some shots so you could see some pictures and some clips this was size eight I just love the colors of this it's very bright out there and because the leaves are growing back you know i mean sometimes the weather can be dull but because it's raining when the sun comes out we're gonna be shining together like together together and one more clothes oh go and then we're done this one this one I did too much. <laughs> Over too much was worrying me when I bought this. Seriously, I, I don't understand what happened, but let me bring this to rest to you. I don't know if you see those little pattern. Bro, this dress was dressing. It has elastic to the front, the hand right here, the waist. And then it is just maxi dress. Okay, maxi and it is lined. I'm not gonna wash this with the machine. I'm gonna hand wash it. <laughs> We're not doing that. And then it also comes with a belt. So to cinch you right in, hold that waist and pull it together. Duh! This is lined. I'm hoping. Yep, it's lined. So it feels a little bit thicker and it also feels like if you put it in the machine it's gonna shrink you know that kind of material so 
I love this because what is Ninja? They call this brocade, brocade kind of material. That is why I loved, you know, if you're Nigerian, you understand. Um, oof, this is giving pricey. <laughs> so this was by Lily Pulitzer, Pulitzer, Lily Pulitzer. TJ has been carrying this, you know. Um, original price of this was $340. $8.99.99 lower the value but this is one of those dresses you see and you, you'll be like you know what I only have one of these so you don't mind paying that amount of money <laughs> just excuse 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 so those are all the clothes that I got I have one sunglasses no I like I have a lot of sunglasses so let's see where are the sunglasses you know i had told you that i'm gonna stop buying sunglasses but i told you i was gonna stop buying the designer sunglasses but that does not stop me from buying regular glasses that's like nine dollars and 99 cents and because goss has been killing it out there people has been killing it out there they have that Loewe, 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 Celine. all these houses have been like killing it like the what is it the alien sunglasses that people are wearing i'm not sure what's going on i think which other house is that right that is a little bit more on the affordable side i said from nostrum i tried that and i was like nah thank you but i'm now about to be walking around looking like a, like an alien that yeah, mistakenly came to earth because if i'm alien i'm not coming to this this earth no i'm not coming to earth i will oh, stay in my planet because shit happening here anyways this is the first one i have kind of see the house that these sunglasses is duping right now is it is it gucci i love the big sunglasses frame and this is gonna be us spring because the sun will be springing after the rain and then during summer because the sun is just gonna be out there chilling and killing us on earth so this is by matter still words and i grabbed this for twelve dollars um trying to see the trying to see the number i think it's the z h m s o six two zero dash r i think that's the number just in case you need to look for it but i love these sunglasses and i think i got it for 12 dollars so it was a little bit more expensive than the rest of the ones i'm going to show you i'm going to be careful because i don't want to you know so the next one i grabbed i don't know where i was going with this but i was feeling it because the small frames are like trending right now i saw this by lucky brand for nine dollars and 99 so and I grabbed it because it's gonna make me look like Papa Jasko Alinko in Papa Jasko if you're Nigerian, you know. Mm -mm. I'm trying not to look too straight to the you know so that you don't get blinded, <laughs> but this is gonna be us the whole of spring and summer and even winter of this year. We are ready. And this was nine dollars and ninety nine cents, and it is Havana, the name, and the code is S L B D one O two. Just in case you're looking for that, and then the last trendy dupe that I'm gonna sh show you. I don't know who, which houses made this that they duped from, but I'm loving it because it's, it's this little frame glass and i wanted something all black because as much as i have a lot of like sunglasses i really have more brown i don't really have too much of black black because it makes me look too serious so i don't really gravitate but i wanted something black and uh, here i go <sighs> excuse me Excuse me, you can't be talking to me. Excuse me. Who are you talking to? 
no way was it no way so and i won this already so i can i think this was nine dollars and this is by french connection and the code is ns1022 just in case you're looking for it period so those are the sunglasses that are a little bit affordable because nine dollars let me show you one sunglasses yes i did say i'm not buying sunglasses these other sunglasses but i had a little bit money store money and i wanted something black big frame because i already got this trendy frame more affordable i wanted something in my 50 70 years i'll still be wearing so i grabbed me a gucci sunglasses as soon as i saw it from tj mass obviously green dust bag and this is what I got. You know me and cat eye, but this cat eye is more pointy and it has bigger frame. And it just says Gucci on the frame. I'm trying not to do too much of, you know, I don't like too big, wide of a, a frame. So this is decent for me. So that is how it look again. Let's bring it closer to you. I like that it's a little bit pointy on this side. And this is how it looks on your go grabbed me around my side but not too tight this is this is what I, i'm giving what do you think so for my black sunglasses i have one and done hopefully i don't have to look for any extra because your girl ain't got no money for all of this you know original price of this i don't know i think it was 500 but tj mass had it for 199 yes so i had i think 75 dollars in credits um so i put it towards that so that brought brought my price like i think about 120 that's still a lot of money anyways let's do shoes I don't have any designer shoes but I have something like this Kevin Klein shoe as I told you shoe I can wear any kind of shoe this ballerina I think I got it for $22 yes from on um, clearance from TJ Maxx and I've already worn it but you will not know and that's one thing I like about it. I wore it for the whole day and I, you know, it still looked like I didn't wear it. So, I like the little ball going on or something. So pretty. And for all my long maxi dresses, that is going to be it. And this, I forget to tell you to do it when I did the Nostrum rag. But this I got from Nostrum rag. It was on clearance as you see so i grabbed it 25 percent off that's something about this and this is by sam edelman i love sam edelman i love i love his creation so original price of this was 170 dollars it was on clearance for 48 73 25% brought it to like 30 something. I love that it has a little gold here. My partner is like, do they have that in male in the men? Sorry, because he loved that. And I love how it grabs my feet when I put it on socks in the air. And there's no, I hate when I put on shoes, there's like gaps on the side. I hate that like mold around my, my feet. I love that. So very comfortable shoe talking about shoe ah, this one so my teen years oh when i was a teenager rubok was the thing for me okay nike was there but rubok was more accessible for me when i was in barbados so this is what i grabbed and I grabbed it from TJ Maxx for $39.99. So, such a gorgeous, oh, gorgeous shoe. Kind of remind me of the Nike Air Force 
you that everybody's talking about but for some reason i don't really dig into it but this i'm i was excited and i'm still excited about it the last shoe that we have we are springing this time did you see all these colors the last shoe that we have we're gonna do this soon let's put that aside i'm kind of too way about this shoe not because it's not pretty it is very pretty put it on and tie it around you know like padded shoe heel okay i'm really excited about this but the problem is i don't know how long this is gonna wear because the leather feels very cheap for the you know i mean it's 28 29.99 30 dollars so i'm thinking about it it looks really nice but we're gonna see on the try on that is it for the shoes or the shoes that i grabbed i think i have one belt so i love chain belt i have one chain belt that i wear with almost all my dresses because sometimes i don't need the bigger dresses i just uh bigger belt i just need a little chain around to hold everything together and that one i thrifted for like a dollar and i've had it for more than five years now and it's just been going good but i wanted something else to supplement it so that it doesn't get weak so i saw this micro cores one okay so it's gonna go around me and then you pin it and this is how it looks okay so Oof, smells so rusty browsy um this original price was 68 dollars i think i grabbed it for 19 dollars from tj mass so i know it's gonna turn fast but before it turn i hope i wear wear at least more than 20 times so that i can get my cost per wear because i can smell the bras Oof, and I hate to smell grass. Anyways, let's get into the last question of the video, which is the bags. Oh no, let's do. We have one wallet. See, good thing I looked at this. One single wallet, and you know this year I said I'm not gonna be buying a lot of designer wallet because there's so much high end, this uh, high end um SLGs uh wallets precisely out there that you could buy example of it is this one so i did sell all my big designer bag uh wallet because we wear more smaller bags these days and there's no need for that it just sits in my closet so i sold all of them so i've now wanted some just in case i decide to carry more stuff in my wallet and I saw this in my cup course one that has this wrist so I can wear it by itself. This wrist strap I can wear by itself. It's big enough to like hold my phone. And it was original price was $158. It was on TJ Maxx, had a clearance for $40. And this is how it looks when you open it. Okay, the leather is really really nice it's in this bubble leather and it has a zipper side here you can put your phone there put any document you want receipt another zipper on this side you can put anything it has about one two three four five six six card holder on this side um and then it has another side here you could put some other cards if you want and it has another two pocket here you could put your cards if you want but that is you know the one i got and i love love this so this is going to be my collection we're not selling it okay haven't done all of that please don't break hold on i don't want that to break let's do the press now yes Yes, I just showed you a whole, whole, whole 
bag. This is by Saks. I have a bag from the Saks. They're a thrifted there for four dollars, and I love that. I love that this is knitted. Okay, wheat, different colors. Now, if I go to Barbados or I go to any island or travel, this is the bag I'm expected to wear. This is what you wear with the short pants, a nice t-shirt or a nice top with this bag with the slippers. That is how islanders dress. Nobody wears Birkin on the beach. Nobody wears, nobody cares what you wear on the beach. But people mostly wear something that looks like this. I'm not, you know, if you want to go to the beach and carry your Birkin, you can do that. Carry your Dior tote bag, fine. But I'm just telling you, this is what people wear because it's island life and people are simple. That's the simplest, stylish places you will be because most of, you know, it's beachy kind of lifestyle. So people don't dress over dress. I mean, yes, they do dress, but most time people want to go to the beach. And if I'm going to vacation and I'm going to the beach all the time every morning, I want to have a bag like this. I don't, it's like so carefree. I can put it in a machine or wash. And when I saw this from TJ Maxx, I was like, pick, pick, pick. It's a limited um, collection though, because they have it here. And it says, the sucks, limited edition, I'm sorry. So this one I got for $49.99. So this is the front because of this thing. I'm assuming it stays in the front. And you know I'll be carrying everything, like my change of clothes when I go to the beach. If I have to go to the beach and go to dinner from there, like this is what what I envision when I want to go on vacation. This is Barbados, real life. Okay, so that is my first bag, and I'm gonna be wearing it for this um, spring summer. I just. I've tried it with a lot of like my clothes, short, especially short pants. This is given with short pants and just flat slippers and a, a nice shirt, like a t shirt. This is given, and I'm, I just can't wait. <laughs> so, that is the first bag. Let's do the second bag. We're still springing, right? Sorry, this video will be a little bit long. The second bag I have is this one. This is by Stored. I just love the color of this. It is very out there. This is the style of bag that is trendy. Um, Bottega have it. Um, and I really, really didn't want to spend a lot of money. I wanted a bag like this. And I really don't want to spend a lot of money. When I saw this, it has like a cool gold hat. Look at like this. Look at this. Can you see that? When I saw this at TJ Maxx, I grabbed this. Original price of this is $325. So, not too bad for like a trendy piece bag. And I really wasn't trying to spend a lot of money. So, when I saw it for $179, which I think is still expensive. I mean, I'd rather have this as a colored bag rather than paying like fifteen to like three thousand dollars for a bag like this. Okay, so it says third day comes with the dust bag inside. I can wear it like this or wear it like that. It doesn't go on my shoulder. If I go on my shoulder, it goes, but it's too tight. It's close. I mean, it's a little bit off of my armpit, but I'm not going to wear my bag. And when I sweat, it goes on the bag. It just feels good. So that is my third bag. And I'm just so happy for this bag. <laughs> and the last of it all, the bag I thought I would never add in my collection. The brand I thought I would never add to my collection. TJ Maxx made it possible is this oh 
Oh my goodness, let me flip the price and let's just talk about the bag, the color. Let's talk about the color of his bag. Let's, let's just talk about the caramel. Let's, let's adore the beauty of this bag. Just so gorgeous. And it's in this silver hardware. Um, it has this little clip. You can clip it and make it bigger, but I'm not going to be doing that because we are not carrying a lot of stuff to warrant that. Smells like sheep. I think it's cow, cow hill skin. I don't know. Cow sheep skin. Cow sheep. Okay, Betty. Cow sheep. No, it's not cow and sheep together. So sorry, it's some sort of cow skin. Maybe cow skin. I don't know, but it smells very cowy. <laughs> smells very cowy. It comes with a a dust bag and also a crossbody, just in case. The leather. This now. This is what you talk about leather. You talk about leather. So. I've been looking at long charm because a lot of people talk about long charm on YouTube. So this is kind of influence. Not this is a bag, but the brand long charm. I know people talk about buying like their uh, their other kind of bag. What is it called? You can use it to travel. TJ Maxx to carry those too. What is it called? It's not leather. It's a uh, nylon nylon yes nylon material um the long charm that's very lighter than this because this is a little bit heavy i'm thinking maybe i can get like a organizer for this but then if i have organizer won't i have to open this because if i let's open this and see how it works i'm gonna do a total review of this because i really want to talk about this bag because that's the first bag this is how it look if you don't wanna just so gorgeous so pretty um i did grab a smaller one of this i had in gray i had to return it because it was 299 dollars and i'm not sure why the original price was like i think four or five hundred dollars so when i saw this one for 299 dollars again in this brown i was like just come i don't know if someone mistaken because when i check this online i think this is going for 600 dollars on tj Maxx. i think this bag i don't know i don't know what happened but it was marked as 299 dollars so your girl went ahead and grab it so that is my last uh, that is my last item for this haul what do you guys think i know it's a little bit excessive but still not excessive because most of the things i got on clearance but this are things that I'm really loving. I just have one or two exceptions that I'm still thinking might have to return. But I'm gonna look at my the quality of my other strap shoe shoe straps and I'll compare with that and decide if I need to keep it because I don't want to wear something one time and two time and that's it. If not, then I have to return it. But I love the way it looks. So that is it for this video. What do you guys think? So let me know what you guys think. Let me know. I will see you in my next video. Bye-bye. Now, don't forget to like and subscribe and also leave a comment, okay? I'll see you. Bye.